With the Christmas holiday around the corner, many customers are already adding their favorite Christmas designs to their carts. So in this video, I'll be sharing a simple step-by-step -step process on how I easily discovered high-performing Christmas digital products that have strong demand and how to make them print-ready using Printify. In order to find these high-demand designs for our Christmas wall art, I'll be using the Allura browser extension. This tool helps you discover trending designs much faster. So the first thing I'll do is search for Christmas wall art on Etsy and click the Allura icon. This will display the total revenue, monthly sales, and even when each product was listed. Our goal is to look for products that were posted recently but are already showing steady sales because that proves there's real interest in that design. I'll then filter the creation date to show listings from the newest to the oldest. As a result, I found this Christmas Mega Bundle prints, which includes a total of 120 wall art designs. It was created about 21 days ago and has already made impressive revenue. According to Etsy, this design is a bestseller, and one reason designs like this perform well is because customers love getting a variety of designs in one pack. The next design idea is this vintage Santa with gifts wall art. This design was listed on the 3rd of September and has performed quite well in total revenue. Just last month alone, it generated more than more sales, and the crazy part is that it's not a bundle but a single design. From the reviews, you can see how customers expressed how much they loved this product. The next one is vintage Christmas Santa print, which features a vintage monogram art style. This design was posted a year ago and has already built consistent sales over time. And just this month alone, it has performed very well in total revenue since it was first published. The final design idea is Christmas Village wall art print. This design was also posted last year, but just last month, it gained even more attention. This shows how demanding it is. So, this simple design has continued to perform steadily since it was first published. So, with this simple method, it was easy to find these trending designs and use them as inspiration to create my own. Another thing I noticed that could help improve even further is offering my designs as both digital and physical products. From the reviews, I saw that many customers were printing the designs themselves, so imagine offering ready-to-print versions instead. This would not only attract two types of customers, but also increase your earning potential. And with Printify, the process becomes effortless. With a platform like Printify, selling physical products has never been easier. Printify offers a wide range of popular white label products that you can easily print your designs on. It also integrates directly with popular online stores. And with the Printify AI model, you can automatically generate optimized searchable product information. Your design will be listed on your store automatically. And when a customer makes a purchase, Printify handles both printing and shipping without you ever touching a single product. Keep watching because I'll show you step by step how to set this up. Now, before we start designing, I want to say this, selling on a platform like Etsy is great, especially if you're just starting out. But it's always best to have another online store outside of Etsy so you can grow it alongside your Etsy store. Sometimes, Etsy can suspend your account without giving a clear reason. And setting up your own store is simple. Once you've decided which platform to use, the next step is choosing your domain name. And instead of using .com, I highly recommend going with a .store extension. Why? Because websites with .store domain receive higher engagement and often rank better on Google compared to generic domains. Shoppers immediately recognize .store domain as a place to buy, which helps increase trust and visibility. That's exactly why global icons like Mr. Beast, Cristiano Ronaldo, Rihanna, and Emirates Airlines all use .store domains for their brands. Getting .store domain usually costs around $29. But if you head to checkout and use the coupon code and data, you'll get it at a discounted price with privacy protection included. Even if privacy protection is off, you still get the domain at a lower price for the first year. And that's not all. You'll also get free access to the plus version of Elevate.store when you register .store domain. This premium toolkit is designed to help online sellers grow faster and includes deals and discounts for essential tools like Canva, Shopify, and AutoDS. All free just for choosing .store domain. So, to create this design with AI, I'll use Magic Media in Canva. I'll create a new project in Canva. Choose a custom size, then select 2x3 portrait size. After this, I will go over to Magic Media and enter my prompt for this design in this format in a sketch art style. Imagine a Santa holding a Christmas tree in a vintage monochrome style. After that, I switched the aspect ratio to portrait, and these were the results. Once everything was ready, 
I scaled each design to fit the frame and exported them as PNG or JPEG, but these weren't the only prompts I crafted. I've got a list of ready to use wall art prompts which you'll find in the description and a special thanks to my Patreon supporters for making this tutorial possible. Once you've got your final design, the last step is to make it print ready for Printify. Use a platform like Let's Enhance to upscale your images to higher resolution. After that, send it to Printify to prepare it for printing. Once you've integrated your online store with Printify, selected a poster product and imported your design into their white label catalog, Printify will automatically provide default product details. But to make your product highly searchable, use the Printify AI model. Simply provide a short description of your product and it will generate an optimized title, description and searchable tags for you. Once everything is set, click upload. Finally, if you found this helpful, grab my prompt list in the description below. It'll save you hours of trial and error. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.